Hey guys, this is Ben with Shirt Photography, and I want to show you a quick glimpse into my Neon Studio template. This is way more than a template though, this is like a Neon Factory. There's all kinds of different options, you can create and make whatever you like in this. Let's take a look quick. There's quite a few layers, and there's a tutorial that will explain all the layers and all the different options. You can easily change the colors of this simply by double clicking on the adjustment layers and sliding these to the left or the right to pick out the exact color that you want. You can paint on the mask to add or subtract areas of color. There are all kinds of neon elements that are automatically included in the download with the sports edition. There's a baseball softball, a basketball lines, bowling, cheer, dance, football, soccer, a stopwatch for track, swimming, and volleyball. With the Neon Studio Design Edition template, there's a frame, a circle, a game controller for gamers, an atom symbol for science and math, some cool chess pieces, a cross, wings, arrows, music notes, and lightning. You can even create any design you like. Simply paint in the Neon Magic folder and any line art you draw will automatically turn to neon. You can even add your own logo. So if you have a high resolution logo that's somewhat simplified, so not too complex of lines or shading or anything like that, you can take it into Photoshop. And there are three actions included with this template. There's a line art, a glow for your subjects, and a custom frame option here. So the line art, if I hit play on this logo, it's gonna generate line art for me, and I can drag it into the Neon Magic folder, and it'll generate an awesome logo for you. Since the template is so customizable, it's up to you to enter your own text. There are four different fonts that I've used. If you're in CC, these will automatically download for you. If not, I have the links for you. You can type in whatever you want into any of those fonts. I'm going to shut the other ones off that I don't need, and it's easy as that. Lighting your subjects will be important for this template. There's actually a tutorial and a lighting diagram that help tell you exactly how I lit my subjects. I photograph my subjects on green screen. However, you do not have to. You just have to be able to extract them. I have an extraction action that I use and is available on my website. It's as easy as a few buttons here. And she is extracted. Now I simply put her into the template and position her where she needs to go. And her feet will automatically disappear and I can resize to fit the perfect size, and I can add the element behind her. There's also a glow action that I can run on her to give her an even more realistic look. I just hit play on my glow action, and it prompts you to select a color. And I hit play again, and it creates an awesome glow around your subject. There are so many different options included with this template, they're going to want to watch the full tutorial to make sure that you understand and can apply all the different options that are available to you. You're only limited by your imagination.